guys welcome back to another episode of keep me learning thank you so much from wherever you're watching me thank you so much for joining me and i'm back here again with another so thank you thank you so much thank you thank you for supporting this channel for subscribing commenting sharing this content and as well as learning from me it's my pleasure and I'm so humbled thank you thank you so much now let's go ahead now the first word or the first uh, the first uh, thing we are going to learn is definitely going to be to keep money. You know, anywhere where money is concerned or business, where business is concerned, there is always something to do with money. So, we are putting our focus on money and business. So, what do we say to keep money in Kikuyu? To keep money in Kikuyu, koigabia, koigabia. As you can remember last, in my previous video, I mentioned money is also called besha, besha. So you can also say koiga besha, koiga besha. That's just another, uh, another form of saying to keep money. Koigabia. Now, the next one will be to look for money. To look for money. We are always looking for money all over the world. Like everywhere and everybody who is above 18 or even not yet 18. I mean, every adult is in this life looking for money, chasing for money and working to get money. You know, money is... is like, yeah, if you want to live in this world, at least you need to have some money. Not a lot, but some. So, to, uh, to look for money. Gosaria bia. Gosaria bia. Gosaria bia. Or, you can also say, Gosaria besha. Gosaria besha. Some people will say Wosaria. Some will also say Wosaria, which boils down to the same thing. So it doesn't matter. It, see, uh, it just means the same thing. So Wosaria Besa. Wosaria Bia. It's just the same to look for money. <laughs> now, excuse me. The next one will be will be i'm going to look for money i'm going to look for money i'm going to look for money every day every other day i go to work i'm looking for money i'm hunting i'm you know yeah gosharia bia dadie gosharia bia i'm going to look for money i'm going to look for money now excuse me a little bit i just need to just give me a second i 
I'm going to look for money. Dadie go sharia bia. Dadie go sharia bia. Or dadie go sharia besa. Dadie go sharia besa. The next one will be I'll bring your money. I'll bring your money. You know, you owe someone some money. You want to bring them the money. Or you've you've uh, bought something. You purchased something. You want to like bring the money to to do the transaction. So you just say nego kurehera bia shiaku. I'll bring your money. Nego kurehera bia shiaku. Nego kurehera. I'll bring you bia money. Shiaku your money. Your money. Nego kurehera bia shiaku. Nego kurehera bia shiaku. I'll bring your money. Or I will bring your money. Now I'll return your money. I will return your money. Nego o shokeria bia shiaku. Nego go shokeria bia shiaku. Go shokia is to return. Nego go shokeria. I will return. Nego go shokeria bia shiaku. I will return your money or I will I'll return your money. Wo shokia to return. Wo go shokeria bia return your money. Shiaku yours. The next one is take the money. Take the money. Take the money and go. Take the money and go and buy something take the money and make yourself happy you know everything it can mean anything take the money how do we say that in kikuru oya bia oya bia take the money oya bia or you can say oya besha take the money oya besha Besha or Bia. By now, I think everybody knows it's either Besha or Bia. The two words. Anything to do with money, Besha or Bia. Take the money. Oya Bia. Come pick the money. Gera Bia. Come pick the money. Gera Bia. Come pick the money. Or come take the money. Gera Besha. Gera bia or gera besha, which means come pick the money. There is money. Kwena bia. There is money. Kwena bia. You know, when the business is getting successful or the economy is growing and successful, you just say, you know, there is money. There is, there is cash. There is, you know, you just say kwena bia. Queen Abia, there is money, you know, which is the opposite of Gotire Bia. There is no money. There is no money. So you can say there is money. There is money. Queen Abia. Queen Abia. Or Queen Besha. Now, wait for a month. You know, when you. Okay. You are employed, you are talking to your employer, you want to ask for your pay or money, and they will tell you, wait for end month. Just wait for end month. You'll get your money. Wait for end month. Eterera moiso wa moeri. Eterera moisho wa moeri. Eterera is to wait. Moisho end month moeri. Eterera moisho wa mweri eterera moisho wa mweri or eterera moisho wa mweri wait for end month and the last word in this video tonight today i'm used to saying tonight that's why anyway the last 
word in this video today is going to be we get paid on end month we get paid on on end month so how do we say that in kikuyu we get paid on end month tore haguo moisho wa mweri tore haguo moisho wa mweri we get paid on end month tore haguo moisho wa mweri we get paid on end month you know many people get their pay during the end of the month so you just say tori haguo moisho wa mweri maybe someone is asking you when do you get your pay mori haguo re mori haguo re like mori haguo comes from the word kore huo which is uh to pay so you just someone will ask you when do you get paid or when do you receive your salary mori hagori mori hagori when do you get paid or when do you receive your salary uh, okay i think that one will be com let's concentrate on when do you get paid mori hagori and the person will answer and say tori haguo moisho wa mweri we get paid on end month or we get paid at the end of the month that's how it will mean what if someone ask ask you when do you receive your salary mori haguo moshara re mori haguo Mosara re more hago is to pay it comes from the word to pay moshara is the the salary the salary is called mosara or moshara moshara actually depending on which part of central province you come from you can say moshara or mosara moshara or mosara which means the salary re is when when do you get your salary more hago moshara re or more hago mosara re ladies and gentlemen this brings me to the end of this beautiful video today Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for staying around. And as usual, if you really enjoyed this video, don't forget to give me a like, subscribe to this channel, share this content, and I hope you are you are getting to learn this language. I hope we are coming along and until we meet again next time, please Stay safe wherever you are and good day and goodbye.